It's a story of Tony and Candace. We wanted to explore their history. Where did they come from? How did they meet? Is it what you expect? It's not. It's really not. Were they always friends? Was it always Portland? Does one of them drive a sports car? <laughs> Got a little bit of funk at the end for the sports car. Yeah. <laughs> There's a medical episode. Can you feel the heartbeat? Hear the ambulance? Are you scared? Are you a hypochondriac? Do you I... trust your doctor? Does he or she always tell you, you're fine? But you're like, no, I'm not. I'm not fine. I have all these symptoms, these vague symptoms. I like to sleep. There's kind of a general malaise. That's the ambulance coming to get you. Is it real? No, it's not. <laughs> Dead pets. That's all taxidermy is. Do you have a former loved one that's furry? Do you want to keep it around forever? Do you have a coffee shop or a store that you want to make look better? Do you want to order your espresso while a little deer looks over your head? Do you have respect for the animals? Should they be on display? Or should they be buried? Proper burial. Dead pets. It's actually a comedy. Yeah, it's all fun stuff. It's really fun. It's really, <laughs> please, it's all fun. No, it seems heavy, but it's, it's, that's just you know, it's just like it, it feels dark. It feels, it, it, it's you know, all in celebration. It's of like it. it has nothing to do it's with happened. animal rights or PETA. It's it's, it's really so just it, I'm like it's just who it's cares? Just, just, I have so much taxidermy in my house. It's all sugar. It's, it's, it's based on our own like trophy hunting kind of lifestyle. No and, judgment. Yeah. None whatsoever. God, when's the next time we're going on a safari?